Hello Gemini people. This is a much awaited time you've been looking for. This is a January of 2023 where your Ashtamashani comes to an end, making a lot of your worries go away hopefully. This is a time when Saturn moves out of your 8th house of death taxes and a lot of losses and worries into your 9th house, bringing significant relief. From the 9th house, it aspects your 11th house. So definitely there are some people who are going to be dropping off your social circle. As you realize they were not really your true friends. You can also expect some uh, issues with siblings. So do handle that with kid gloves. Some of the Gemini individuals who've been trying to wrap their heads around, you know, paying off debts. This is a time when uh, the debts can also get paid off. So work earnestly towards, you know, just paying them off. Uh, Jupiter from the 10th house will move in the month of April and into your 11th house of infall gains and profits. So keep working hard, continue to do what you're doing and there are likely to be uh, significant gains. There is also going to be elevation of status, power, recognition of on, on some big platform for the skills that you have or what you bring to the table in your organization, business or family environment, whichever the space be in accordance to the role that you play. Rahu is in your uh, 11th house and in the 11th house it will give you good outcomes. One thing that the Gemini individuals need to be careful about is that roughly for a period of six months or so, starting May to the month of November, Jupiter and Rahu are going to be together in your 11th house, aspecting your 5th house. So especially individuals who are in financial difficulty should really, really stay away from get-rich-quick schemes because this is a phase that may bring insatiable appetite or may uh, create the risk appetite a little more than what it should be for you. So make sure you're not putting in your money in some get-rich-quick scheme or you're not trying to double your money or make too much money too quick. Uh, and in fact, it can land you in a space of a greater loss or in greater trouble. So be sharp about choices that you make during this period. Um, this is also a phase where you would do well to rely on your own counsel or that of a mentor who you can trust rather than follow blindly people who may be offering uh, advice but may not have your best interests at heart. I hope you choose wisely and I hope there is great comfort and relief for you as 2023 begins.